Joe Gattenby joins us for the intermission, find out a little bit more about Joe. What's it like playing with the Okanagan Rockets this season? You're having a good season. Yeah, it's uh, it's been really great. They treat us really well here and uh, definitely right up there with like a preparing us for junior hockey and above and the coaching's been really good and everything's been really top notch so I've been really enjoying it. You feel they are preparing you then for the next level either CIS or down the states or the WHL? Yeah for sure I think uh, just the BCMML league and everything about the whole experience with the Rockets is definitely helping me to get to the next level. Why the success of the team so far? Uh, I think we have a lot of we have a lot of strong players in this room but it takes a little bit more than that to be successful and I think we're buying into the system and we're we're playing our roles and playing well and being creative and having fun like that's the biggest thing that is the biggest yeah. thing why hockey obviously it's fun but why hockey did you ever play any other sports uh pretty much from uh, like when I could walk my dad put skates on me and uh <laughs> And then I, I, at first I wasn't like, I was kind of like scared, you know, I didn't, I didn't like to leave my mom and my mom had to come on the ice with me and stuff. But uh, no, just once you kind of, like once I started having success with it, then it just, you know, it became more fun and more fun. And then I just kind of stuck. Like I played other sports. I played lacrosse a little bit when I was younger, but when it came to time to decide, it wasn't really that hard of a decision for me to stick with hockey because I just liked it more. Mom doesn't have to be on the bench still. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> hobbies. you have any hobbies? you get to do anything other than just play hockey? Uh, well, I, I like to try to golf in yeah. the summer. I'm not very good. I, hopefully I can get better at that. But I, I, I like to play pretty much any sport. And anything that's competitive I'll jump into. But nothing really like too organized or anything cause, you know, with, with how much commitment level you need for this level of hockey. You can't really do that too much. Athletes are so superstitious. I know when I was going to high school, I had some superstitions. Do you have superstitions? I, I try to stay away from that. I, I don't like to, I, I like to just kind of, you know, I don't want to have something where, you know, if you don't have it happen, then you're going to get all psyched out or anything. I just like to kind of have fun and try to, you know, I don't really, yeah, not really for me. For food? Do you have something that you, either you have to eat before a game or just you just like enjoying on a Tuesday? Uh, yeah, no, I don't, for food, I don't really... Don't really do too much. I, pretty much the only thing I cook though is eggs because it's just so easy. You know, <laughs> just crack her and crack a couple eggs and have that. But nothing. scrambled. What, what do you like? Pretty much the easiest you can get. Just crack her in a little mixer cup and <laughs> scramble them up and put them in the microwave with some cheese and whatever else, bread and stuff. And yeah. it's pretty easy on the go. How about this? I love asking this question. Uh, one thing people don't know about you that you're willing to share with us. Well, I don't know how willing I am, willing I am to share this, but uh, no, in grade six I was in a Calgary Spelling Bee, so it was kind of something something different, I guess. No doubt. Did you have to qualify? Did you? How did you get to the Calgary Spelling Bee? Uh, well, I had to win the school for, like, it was grade five to eight, and then I won out of my school. It wasn't that big of a school, but then you had to you had to write this written it, it kind of exam spelling test to get into the qualify for the Calgary one and I got into there and then you know you get there and I was just like there's all these kids that are really really intense and I just had not not really done it but I didn't do too bad and it was kind of a different experience so it was fun. How do, did you win? The, you didn't win the Calgary Stel- Spelling Bee. Oh no there's there's much better spellers than me out there but. Grade I, six though do you remember the, the word that you lost on? Huh? Uh, yeah it was Ensign and it's actually spelled E-N-S-I-G-N so I had no chance whatsoever. So. Well, you know it now though. Yeah, I do. I do. Joe, thanks for doing this. Yeah, thanks very much. Joe Gattenby joining us for the intermission. Thanks for watching.